Every Rite Aid location in Michigan is going to close. The pharmacy chain confirming that news to Fox 17. Now experts are saying if that's your provider, you should find a backup plan and fast. We're uh, disappointed uh, the same way that everybody else is. A big announcement with even bigger implications. Patients with these closures are actually going to be losing their direct access to a, to a health care consultation right there in their community. More bankruptcy documents filed on behalf of Rite Aid Corporation. The drugstore chain confirming all Michigan locations are set to close. To see them withdraw from Michigan is going to be a huge blow to the profession and to the patients that they're serving. Eric Roth with the Michigan Pharmacists Association says their disappointment is not directed at Rite Aid, but rather at pharmacy benefit managers. That's the entity that sits between the pharmacy and your health insurance. Pharmacy benefit managers do their best to squeeze profit margins out of pharmacies, taking more money from patients down the line and creating an environment where it is just not sustainable for pharmacies to stay in business. Right Aid, not alone. CVS and Walgreens have already shut down hundreds of stores, with the latter promising to close a quarter of its nearly 9,000 countrywide locations by 2027, hurting an industry that's already struggling with a medication shortage. What you'll see is that inability to procure that med medication uh, compounded in, in terms of, of how problematic it is because now uh, they have all these new patients that are increasing the demand um, at those stores, uh, at their new stores when they couldn't get the medication to fill for their current population. Still, Roth says not all patients need to hit the panic button. That being said, we do have concerns for any patients that may not have another uh, pharmacy solution in the, in their area. So if that happens to be your case, I would recommend reaching out to your Rite Aid uh, in particular and see what their recommendations are for uh, continuing your prescription services. Now, a high volume of prescription transfers usually leads to longer wait time. So Rose says if you need to make a switch, you should do it sooner rather than later. Rite Aid telling me all Michigan stores will be closed by the end of September.